Maddie is going to Syracuse University and their colors are orange and navy. And I just happen to have, which you can't tell, I can see, orange ironing board, this piece of canvas left from when I was doing my canvas bags and it happens to be orange. So, I found this symbol for Syracuse, which I think is really cool. Got it printed out on some canvas. So I've got two of those that I will make as pockets. These won't be, the pockets won't be as big as they normally are. In fact, I guess the only issue with that will be that the straps are going to be pretty close together um, up at the top. I'm going to put these, I already have these made. Um, so I will put this probably as close to that edge as I can like that so that might not be too bad so it'll just be a matter of putting the bag together it's Maddie's 18th birthday on Saturday so I thought that would be pretty cool to have that ready for her birthday and I'm thinking I might get some green canvas and make Rosie one for her birthday so that would be pretty cool too so we shall see. We're going to put that together today, this afternoon. Bag's going together. Just a little update on Maddie's bag. Um, I folded this across twice and stitched both ends. And the pockets have a lining. So I've sewn that on, pressed it out, um, and have sewn... Uh, this piece of webbing along the bottom of the pocket. So next I'm going to use the remainder of this to do the rest of this. So I probably could have put that those pockets up a little higher because they could be right at the bottom of the bag. But you know what? You put anything heavy in that pocket, it's going to drag it down anyway. So anyway, the next step is to put all the webbing around and then you're just going to well, sew the sides, and then the part I really don't like is making the bottom, that V. Anyway, there we go. The webbing is all sewn on, and I just use the orange bobbin thread so it doesn't show through too much, and the navy on the top. So now I'm going to sew the sides together. And i got to remember how we do this because we do it twice. And I believe we do it right side out first time with a quarter inch seam. And then we turn it inside out and we do like a 5 8 seam or a half inch seam. So, time for the side seams, then the bottom, then the bag's done. Quick and easy.